Hey guys, it's your man Blue Rapid, and today we are looking at the second part, or at least a different trailer of the Kingdom Hearts 3 trailer that we saw earlier yesterday. This one is a bit different from what I have seen and been told. This one is supposed to uh, show us just clips of this and that, and then at the end show us Riku and Mickey talking with one another, and then Riku's Keyblade seems to be broken. Now, I don't exactly remember how it broke because he did have it in um dream drop distance and maybe he broke it when he fought against young xehanort i'm not exactly sure it's all kind of just a blur uh i need to go back through and play that definitely before the third one comes out i guess but the reason why this trailer is really really interesting is that we get to hear the new song that they're going to have for the kingdom hearts 3 like they had simple and clean and sanctuary for the first and second ones now this one is going to be for the third one and so i'm really interested in hearing what the song is going to sound like uh, i did have a friend who was trying to make me listen to it and i was like no i must have authentic reaction when i first hear it i will not let you ruin it for me I did it for you guys all right i did it for you so without further ado let's jump into this reaction Final game will feature tech. Yes, in English. I hope. It better, or I'll be mad. Cannot see through the little theme song. Don't think twice. <laughs> and people who say things they don't really mean. This is beautiful. Mean. Oh, you're only everything I ever dreamed. Ever dreamed of. Ever dreamed of. You must be kidding me. Did you really think? <laughs> Right here. This is what I saw. Don't make fun of my dancing. Shut up. Riku looks pretty good. Mickey's smiling. Well. Why not? I'm confused. What does that mean? What other me? Does he have a nobody? Intriguing. Very, very intriguing. I would have laughed if this one had like the actual release date. <laughs> so I really liked that song. It was really nice. It was simple and clean. <laughs> but at the same time, it had some maturity to it because this is a game that has been around since for at least a, uh, f maybe 15 years. And so a lot of us who originally played this game, yes, this is a game directed more towards the younger uh, audience, but it is meant for people like me who originally played this game when we were the younger audience. So it does show a bit of maturity in the song, and I do like that. But one thing I did find confusing is the fact that, like I said, like Riku's blade is or keyblade is broken and so he can no longer use it so it has no more power. I thought the keyblade in a sense represented their heart like kind of like <laughs> kind of like a zanpakuto in a sense like it is them and like all they had to do was fix their own heart or something I, you know that's what the sort of thing I was meaning like it should me it should be fixed. It should be able to fix itself if if you want it to be fixed, if you if you focus hard enough on it, it should fix itself. So I'm kind of confused as to why, one, it's not fixed, and two, why that means it's no longer good. Does that mean now he has to go find a new Keyblade? Or 
because that's the whole thing that's confusing me. It's like it should come from the heart, and the only thing that changes it is the 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 keychains, right? So how do you just go and like, oh, well this is this is nice. I like this one. I like this one. I'm gonna keep it. This one's mine. Like it it just makes no sense. But it does make an interesting story that they may possibly add to the game where you and King Mickey uh, travel around and and try to find something and then he, Riku ends up with a Keyblade which then leads to them to being in the final battle which would be a really cool way to handle that especially if he still has some sort of power because I was told the thing that the biggest part or biggest trouble was the fact that he still felt darkness in his heart and he needed to find a way to get rid of it though they made it seem as if that he turned it may still be darkness but it's good darkness like black like me i'm good darkness i'm the, I'm the good kind okay black don't crack baby black don't crack nope and i do like both his and mickey's outfits uh it does look good i, I like it i like it in, in typical uh square Enix fashion for whatever reason they have new outfits and those outfits stay with them the entire time. <laughs> I kind of really want to see what they're going to do. Like, I want to know, like, what's what's the purpose behind this game? Are we going to play as other characters? Or is there going to be more than one story? Is the game going to last I me mean, until they say, hey, just so you know, we're working on something new for you guys. Like, I don't want to finish this game up in a month, you know? Uh, even if, like, I stream it on a somewhat regular basis, I want to be able to play it for a long time and say yo i'm not even close to being done that's what i want and i feel like it's going to be that way but at the same time i'm scared uh it's the uncertainty if you will like just jumping off of a cliff and hope a uh, cliff jumping off of a cliff and hoping that it's going to be a safe landing and that's that's the thing like your friends are like oh it's fine but the what if that's what scares us and that's what scares me right now uh, what do you guys think? Are you guys scared that this game is not going to live up to the hype? Uh, or are you just so excited that they're finally doing something? Like anything that you're you're just happy. You're just happy that it's there. Let me know in the comments below because I want to know what other Kingdom Hearts fans think. Because in my opinion, it's, it's going to be a good game. It's going to be a good one. It's just a matter of is it going to live up to the weight of that we had to experience in order to get to it but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you press that like button and share with your friends so that they can enjoy it too and if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel and follow me on facebook twitter instagram and tumblr so you can stay up to date on all my activities whether it be youtube twitch or just random stuff to make you guys laugh because you know that's what i'm here for so hopefully i'll see you guys next time but until then deuces